Hello, my name is Petra Sargent and I'm a technical writer for Developer Tools. Today I'm going to show you how quickly you can get your local application environment up and running by using Red Hat Development Suite. Let's get started by going to developers.redhat.com and click download. There are several places to download Development Suite. I would like to get a list of all the available downloads. So I'll scroll down to Developer Tools and click Learn More under Red Hat Development Suite. Next, I'll click Download to see a list of all available downloads. Red Hat Development Suite is available on Windows, Mac, and Rail 7. I am using a Windows machine, so I will download the Development Suite Windows installer. There are two options. The first option is an online installer that downloads the components during the installation process. The second option is an installer that has an initial download of 1 gig and includes some of the products in the installer. I'll click the second option. In order to download Development Suite, you must register and have an account for the Red Hat Developers Program. I already have an account, so I will enter my credentials. Now, Development Suite is downloaded and installing. This is the login page for Development Suite. Provide your Red Hat Development Program credentials here to get access. The installer will automatically detect the existing Red Hat products and tools that meet the requirements. Before it gets started, select the installation folder. I'll use the default location. I'll click Next. Development Suite is checking for products that are already installed on my machine. Four components are installed. Red Hat Development Suite detected several components already installed on my machine. OpenJDK is installed, Hyper-V was detected on my machine, along with Sigwin. Red Hat Developer Studio, Red Hat Container Development Kit, and Compose are selected to be installed. I will click Download and Install. During installation, Development Suite will provide an update of progress. It will mark the component complete when installation is finished. Everything's installed and you're good to go. What's next? You can open Developer Studio or start your own local OpenShift cluster using Hyper-V.